All right, tonight marks the anniversary of an unforgettable storm for many in South Carolina, the landfall of Hurricane Hugo. Meteorologist Rich Rogers takes a look back at the rare Category 4 hurricane impacts of the Carolinas and here in the CSRA. Hugo is now a dangerous, extremely dangerous Category 4 hurricane with winds of 135 miles per hour. Anyone about 30 years old or more will remember it. The year was 1989. On this night, 25 years ago, Hurricane Hugo slammed into the South Carolina coast just east of Charleston. Storm surge in Charleston County ranged from 10 to 20 feet. Hugo was the strongest hurricane to make landfall in the U.S. in 20 years. You're looking at a satellite loop showing Hugo as it developed over the tropical Atlantic waters and headed toward the U.S. Notice the enormous eye of the hurricane as it approached the east coast. Like many hurricanes, Hurricane Hugo came off the coast of Africa as a tropical wave and it developed on September 10th, turning into a Category 1 hurricane by September 13th, 1989. Quickly, it uh, managed to become a Category 5 hurricane before it reached the islands here and it made landfall in Puerto Rico as a Category 3 on September 18th, 1989. Caused more than a billion dollars of damage, by the way. And then we started to see Hugo strengthen once again as it moved into the warm Gulf waters here. Of course, the Gulf Stream moving up the Atlantic coast and uh, hurricanes just love warm water and that strengthened it to a category four on September 21st as it was preparing to make landfall just east of Charleston, South Carolina on midnight, September 22nd. Then the remnants of Hugo moved into the Carolinas up into the Appalachians and eventually turning into a remnant low in Canada. Now lots of rain from Hurricane Hugo as well in our area, anywhere from one to five inches of rain. And you can see pretty much along the Georgia Carolina coast, lots of rain. That's where we were heaviest hit with the rain, but much of the eastern part of the country picking up lots of rain from Hurricane Hugo. At landfall, Hurricane Hugo was a category four on the Saffir Simpson scale with winds of 135 miles per hour. Here in the CSRA, our South Carolina counties were most affected by Hugo. In addition to heavy rain, most of Bamberg County lost power and damaging winds extended into Aiken County. Here for you, I'm meteorologist Rich Rogers.